Hey guys, welcome back. Sorry I wasn't here this morning to uh, give you a live update. It's just after lunchtime now, and I would like to show you what's really going on. News media is all owned by five people. They all have the same objective in mind, to keep you watching TV and not doing your own research. Here, I'll do my best to give you the truth. What? <coughs> it doesn't matter if you believe or not, the ones in control do. Sure, I could be labeled a crazy right-wing conspiracy guy, but I don't fall on either side not right or left. I'm just trying my best to get people to open their eyes because I have a six-year-old son who has to grow up in the world that we are creating. Each day that I pay attention, I notice this world is getting more and more violent. The mainstream media has no problems covering this violence. In my opinion, it is only to control the people with fear. Maybe we should take a look at what they are saying. So, let's go to the news. A monster right, category 5 storm with sustained winds of 185 because, uh, miles per hour, here. now gusting to over 200 miles Brian. per hour. Uh, Dorian is gaining strength impact, as it continues its slow march toward the U.S. Page. It is the the strongest storm I'm on the planet this year, the, and know, right now it's on, lashing uh, the Bahamas, so really um, Abaco Islands, out, after but, making uh, landfall just there just saying. the last hour. It's next target, the southeastern U.S. coast. This is a, a hugely threatening storm, but it's also very ominous because it's so unpredictable and slow. But yeah, that's that's the main thing. It's so slow and this is incredibly powerful. This is incredibly powerful. This is not just barely a category five. This in, this tops the category five threshold by leaps and bounds. This is the strongest storm to ever hit the Bahamas. It, this is the strongest storm to ever hit the Bahamas. It has made that first landfall, afraid. the Abaco Islands, you know, which is part of bad. the Bahamas, and it is moving I, at I a snail's pace. You can pretty much uh, walk regularly. fast or um, jog faster than this storm is going. Yesterday. And it's going to sit over the Bahamas for a changed. good 36 hours Girl, at least up. before That's... making that northward turn. And it's going to sit over the Bahamas for a good 36 hours at least before making that northward turn. And so when you think about that, 185 mile per hour winds, gusts higher than 200 for a 36 hour duration, that is that is unprecedented. That is unprecedented. Nearly every mainstream media outlet is trying to convince their audience that this is an unprecedented monster storm. They're telling us this is a classic hurricane with a classic eye wall like and that it's a monster. So, uh, and then they tell channel. us that the wind speeds are 185 dude. miles per hour with gusts and up to over I'll 200 show you what miles see. per hour. Uh, looks like the webcam that I removed from my laptop is recording. Yeah, I got my laptop in pieces. Now I'm upside down. There it is. So this is Biscayne Bay. Uh, it's a still shot. So it's not really showing as much. Let's see what we can do. Well, let me go to live feed. There we go. That's the live feed right now. Uh, I'm not seeing any hurricane. It's some kind of plane or something flying right there. Might be a bird. I can't really tell you what it is, but yeah. Now the camera looks way better. Uh, this camera is. I, I took my laptop apart and I integrated it into my little studio I built here. And I haven't put the webcam yet. I haven't used it for anything yet. I don't usually use this one. But as we see, this right here is not doing much. Let's see what other webcams we can find and check. Okay, hurricane, hurricane, hurricane. 
Hurricane Dorian treasure Space Coast Beach Camps position to show Hurricane Roaring Ashore and is buffering. Alright, let's pause this for a minute until I get something to show you. And it's buffering again. Son of a... Try it again. There's no way to... Full screen. Looks like a typical day at the beach here in Florida. But, you know, I see a lot of... Gray sky is what I'll call it. later on in the day. Uh, this is Cocoa Beach. And it's buffering. Wow. Looks pretty choppy. Not seeing huge waves. The hurricane, it's, it should be pretty close to us now. Time is it? Oh no, my other. Yeah, <laughs> I got hacked on my other computer and I'm reformatting it now. That's why I'm on the. I call it Frankenstein. I don't know what time it is. It's just after dark. Hey Kyle, we had a pretty good day today. Let's check another camp. Here we go, Hutchinson Island, it's live. It's a nice thumbnail. Looks like Hutchinson Island. Check another cam. Alright, St. Lucie Inlet, uh, Port St. Lucie. Buffering. This one had noise on it. Buffering. Why are these all running so slow? Might be rain. Looks like it's picking up a little. Kill that volume. Yeah, it's pretty cool that you can uh, access webcams via YouTube. Let's find another one. This isn't actually YouTube though, it's uh, the TC Palm. It's got a whole list of webcams you can, ac you can access to. Uh, Kennedy Space Center, you can't really see a whole lot here. Not seeing much. It's kind of hard to keep the camera right. Let's see. We'll try another one. Oh, I'm recording. Underwater uh, webcam. Where was this? Let's see where it was. Oh, Deerfield. Yeah. It, this is a cool, a cool cam. I like to watch it, but it's down due to Hurricane Dorian. We'll be back up when things return to normal. Meanwhile, please enjoy some highlights. Let's just check some highlights out anyway, so I can probably use them as good backgrounds later. Oh my.
my god, why, why is everything freaking buffering now? I got good signal. Uh, I hope they didn't hack this one too. It's amazing, when you, when you try to do something to help people, there's so many people that come out of the woodwork and screw you over. I definitely took a, a major attack on one of my laptops and trying to salvage it. It was $2,500. And I mean, might live on a residual income, but I'm not Donald Trump. And it's just buffering. Look at that roof. Is that a little shark? It looks like a little shark right there, maybe. I don't know what it is. Can't tell because it's buffering. Hey, they. All right, let's go to our satellite, or the uh, Ventusky Sky app that I use. Well, I can't see myself in the video. <laughs> anyway, it's this is uh. Cover it. I don't know what I did. Help! I need a brain or something. This is my friend Bun Bun here. She lives in Orlando. Took some beautiful pictures. Uh, posted about 20 minutes ago. I'll just say in or near the Orlando area. Beautiful shots. Sounds a little more windy in her neck of the woods than it is here. A lot more windier actually. But I'm still, you know, looking at the tree's movement. Doesn't look too bad yet. We're staying tuned. This was about 10 minutes ago she posted this. Love you, Bun Bun. And here we are at the Ventu Sky. I said it right. I didn't make it sound all Jewish. Hey, sometimes the Hebrew blood is strong in this body, okay? Let's just uh, zoom in. Yeah, if you couldn't tell about my big old Jew nose, anyways. We'll zoom, zoom, zoom. Wind speed. Now they're saying 200 miles an hour. All right, I got 53. Usually right up here. Look how it it doesn't look right. I'm sorry, I the conspiracy guy, whatever. I'm sorry, it doesn't look right. Now I've gone through major storms. David, Andrew, Katrina, Francis, Jean, Irene. Storms in Florida, almost 40 years, never evacuated. I've surfed a few times during the storm. Um, I've done wheelies. The coolest moment in my life is I had a, a Dodge Neon, and I'm driving through the center of town. There's not a soul in sight. I'm doing 120 miles an hour, and uh, I flip a cigarette out the window. And I was going with the wind, so the wind was blowing 120 mile an hour with me. And when I flipped the cigarette out the window, the cigarette just kind of hovered, and then fell straight down. That was one of, one of the cool moments. Another one was a lightning strike on my ninja. Uh, whenever I hit, if anybody's familiar with the area, whenever I hit Martin, Martin County grade, um, what do they call it? Might be called Martin County Highway, I don't know. We used to call it the grade. I don't know what it is now. It's 
Martin County Highway, I think is what it is. Here in Okeechobee, 15 mile an hour winds. Uh, let's check out wind gusts. It looks bad. 114. It's, there's no 225s, though. And I don't watch TV. I check. I check. I try to stay away from technology most of the time because I have Kyle 24/7, and that's that's my main focus in life. I mean, I do want to get messages to you guys, but my main focus is raising a person that I like, that I can stand, and that when he grows up, I'm not going to talk shit about him. You know, that's that's what my main focus is. I homeschool him, and he's doing great. It's awesome. He's supposed to be in kindergarten. And uh, he's already working on second grade stuff. Never mind, he knows the um, almost full First Amendment and the Constitution. You know, if, if somebody's going to line me up politically, it would probably be that I'm a constitutionalist. I can't call myself a liberal because I don't believe in forcing things on people. Um, the libertarians is what I used to be. I, I kind of align a little bit Republic. Yeah, see this? We got another storm off the coast of, of uh, Mexico. And then whenever we come over here, over to China, it's asking to show present day. I'm sorry if the camera's shaking. My arm is getting tired holding this thing. It is, I don't know why it's asking for present day forecast, but whatever. It is present current right now. You got 14W, uh, 91W, and Ling Ling. So, in a world perspective, we got five, one, two, three, four, five storms going. Hey, hey, New York. But, uh, as we sit and complain about everything, Let's check down here at the penguins. Huh? They don't have no houses. It's cold. Let's let's see what's the temperature. How do I get the temperature up here? Come on. Temperature. Well, let's do the first the wind. 94 miles an hour. It's been like this for a week right here. All week long. I haven't said nothing about it because, you know, I'm trying to talk about this. The storm, and hey, I'm not downplaying the storm. Please don't think I'm downplaying it. But what I'm saying is the news media takes something a little bit scary and tries to scare the heck out of everyone because it generates revenue. Can you imagine how much money's been spent for these storms? This storm, and by the looks of it, we got another one heading this way. I'll talk about that later, but check out these penguins, man. 94 mile an hour wind. Negative 9 degrees Fahrenheit. See, uh, down here it's negative 31 is what I've seen flash real quick. But in this 94 mile an hour, some, some spots I see, I've seen 110 miles an hour. But no storm. That's just, that's how it is there. Could you imagine that? Crazy. But there you go. Sydney's cooking their butts off. They got a little swirl going on over here. Uh, China is getting hit by two storms with another one on the way. The United States has Juliet and Dorian now. Ah, boy, babe. Thought hurricane season was almost over. It's what, September 2nd? And it's just beginning. It's going to be fun. I love hurricanes. I usually have a party, but I'm trying to be more responsible for my son now. Nobody's allowed to come over. My friends, stay away. Nobody's allowed to come over. It's me and Kyle. That's all it is. That's all we need. We can go in more depth with all the, the pressure and upper winds, but 
you know, I just, I just want you to take a look at it. Don't, what's it say? Fear not, let ye be feared. Uh, I fear not as I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, for thy is my comfort. Rod, I, I, man, I have to read the Bible again. I can't remember it. It's nothing to worry about. What will happen will happen. It does look like, however, court will be closed tomorrow. No, oh, no, that's a good hundred miles off the coast. I better show up just in case. Well, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you disagree with me, put it in the comments. Um, if you want more different content, leave a comment, let me know. Till then, I wish you peace and love. I'd say God bless, you know, to those who, who follow, God bless. And those who don't, well, blessed be. And I'm going to end this video here. Have a great night.